So a warm welcome to you all. We will be underway very shortly once all the pleasantries are complete. I'm your commentator, Peter Drury, and providing his unique brand of expert analysis, here's Jim Beglin. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. And so the distinctive sound of the UEFA Champions League anthem. single point that's all that's needed for progress here easy to say but at this level anything but to achieve Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Um, Pepe may well need to be at his best. There's a power about his game, thanks to very decent pace for a big man, and he doesn't lose out much in the air either. He could prove to be a very reliable presence here. Yeah, the scourge of so many strikers. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Thrust towards the front line. To safety, and it's Modric. General Carvajal whipped in. Fence has got rid of that. Now the pass played it again. And back out it comes. Goal! Listen, the big names earn their reputations for precisely the reason we've just seen. They have a habit of making their presence felt, and here we are, early stages. He struck wood, and he looks hungry for more. Look, there just wasn't much of a gap to begin with, and to find it, I think it was a fine drive, and I don't think the keeper could have really planned for that. I think he's a bit unlucky in that instance. Real Madrid take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. For me, that just shows their determination to qualify here. There's been a real conviction about them. I've liked that. Real Madrid have hit the front early, a foothold in the game. Well, they've managed to get their noses in front early because they've been much quicker out of the stalls. They've set out high tempo and intensity and look as though they, they want it much more at the moment. Cristiano Ronaldo passes it through. Benzema cut out in the nick of time. First quarter of an hour gone. A good deal hanging on what they can achieve here. A point will do. Out to the flank. A chance! Goes for goal! No, oh, poor contact, nothing on the shot. He was in such a great position in front of goal and you'd expect him to score from there, but somehow he's missed it. Benzema! World-class Karim Benzema! 
and they are disappearing out of sight. Oh, beautifully dispatched. There was no reaching that. Well, you know, sometimes it pays off not to think too much about things, just put your foot through it, and that was a good example. Great contact, and the keeper had very little chance. Real Madrid have a couple of goals without reply, it's 2-0. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. to run away with it. Well, from right in front of goal, there was no way he was going to miss. Benzema is the obvious danger man here, and yet he was afforded way too much freedom. I think he was gifted that goal. His reputation should have been warning enough for them. Three without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Now, can he capitalise? Well, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. He's having a go. Daniel Carvajal. Tony Kroos. Coming on for a third of the way through the game. Cristiano Ronaldo. James Rodriguez tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, that is an awful miss. I think he's done very well to get into such a good position in front of the goal, but he just couldn't put in the telling touch. Oh, that's great stuff. Exactly what he's all about. Yeah, he's definitely a player who looks like he can make something happen every time he's on the ball. He's just full of belief and energy. So what now? Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. I timed this run brilliantly, and I think he has every right to be a little annoyed with, with the passer then, and I think he's letting him know right now about that. Just a little more behind it was needed. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Good running with the ball. Can they build on it? Real Madrid are leading with half-time drawing close. And that's out of reach. Tony Kroos, Cristiano Ronaldo, tries a through ball, Cristiano Ronaldo. Benzema. Plays it out to the wing. Looks like a good ball through. Oh, it's opened up nicely for him. It's come loose. To be fair, that was tough for the keeper to handle. Aimed long and direct. There is the half-time whistle. 
Real Madrid very much in control here, three up and cruising. Just 45 minutes from now, we will know who goes through from this group. Modric goes wide. Cristiano Ronaldo! Gets good distance on it. Marcelo hurtles into the tackle. And he's fouled him there. Tried to play it through. Yeah, it was a case of, of good awareness too. That wasn't quite matched by the, the right way to pass it. Only needed just a little bit more behind it. And he was through. Modric. Aimed in towards the centre. Sticks it away! Over the hills and far away! No catching them now! And Real Madrid do what Real Madrid do best. Look, a big part of Real's potency is still produced by their ability to hit teams on the counter. In that regard, they have two of the world's very best specimens, Bale and, of course, Ronaldo. Real Madrid tear their opponents apart once again. They are utterly ruthless. Looks to slip it through. What an adventurous run from a defender. Must score. And that's left him on the seat of his pants. Oh, great ball. Well, he would surely have scored there more times than not. taken short and that's been repelled big chance what a good way to assert your authority for this second period they were prepared to commit numbers forward into attacking positions and the risk has been deservedly rewarded Cristiano Ronaldo a scorer already in the game. Marcelo, that is a terrific run. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Real Madrid still have two substitutions up their sleeve. And he's made sure that that won't get through. Out wide to the right. it through coaxed out to the wing so who's he picking out they've got it back as soon as they gave it away he's got the ball he's got the space Bale. Sergio Ramos comes sliding in Obviously moved that good inroads into enemy territory, but no joy. Great ball, and now the shot. Well, that was a really awkward one for the goalkeeper to deal with. 
Rafael Varane pumps it upfield. It's Benzema! No, that's just wide. I think when you're in front of goal like that, you really should do better. That's a poor finish in the end. There he is, making his presence felt. Well, he's certainly a player I'd be more than happy to watch. Tactically, he's almost impossible to stop. Looks like a good ball through. The defence can get it clear. Cristiano Ronaldo is an obvious threat from set pieces. He needs special attention to stop making a run. Sergio Ramos charges in. Crunching tackle. That was an exemplary tackle, stopped him dead in his tracks. Benzema! World-class carry Benzema! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front and they really commit forward in numbers too. That was all very well drilled. He snaffles his third and that earns him the match ball. That defence must be sick of the sight of him. He's been persistent and ruthless all game. He just hasn't stopped working. Real Madrid totally rampant here. Almost nothing left on the clock here. Played out to the wing. Now here's the through ball. Tony Kroos. Modric. Cuts it out. It's a move that looked promising, but uh, eventually thwarted without doing any harm. Out to the left it goes. down the right, where could this lead? Looks to slip it through, Benzema, it's Benzema! It's official showing that there will be three minutes of added time. Fine defending there. Well played, he saw that coming. Oh, he's come flying in. And that's it. Real Madrid have made it through to the knockout stage. They can anticipate the draw and the challenge that lies ahead. Well, how will we look back on that? Early qualification is always a good bonus. They've shown resilience and strength and have all the essentials to go on a lengthy cup run. It's all looking pretty good for them. This is a hard one to take, but we'll be that stronger once we make this engagement with you.